A mother from Youngstown, Akaya Hutchins, is still grieving the shooting death of her 18 year old son just last month. But now she's also choosing to speak out about the scourge of gun violence in our city. She talked exclusively to 21's Connor Stephan to share her message. Say I love you, Cornell. I miss you. Long live you. A role model to his younger brothers and star athlete with big dreams. That's how family of Cornell Kennedy Jr. described the 18 year old. But those dreams cut short in June when Kennedy became the victim of a fatal shooting in Youngstown's north side on Seneca Street. To see him laying there and there's nothing I can do to comfort my child, to pick him up, to take him home, it got to stop. It got to stop. Cornell's mother, Akaya, tells me she's still grieving the death of her son, but believes now is the time to give her pain a purpose. I, oh, I'm ready. With a message for the community about the influx of gun violence being seen in the city. We have to come together. Y'all got to stop. Y'all got to stop. In 2021 alone, the city has seen north of 60 shootings. Hutchins says the effort to curb gun violence starts with better parenting. It's hitting too close to home. We got to save our babies. Another issue for Youngstown, a lack of cooperation between investigators and witnesses. Hutchins wants people to know. It's snitching if you tell somebody, no, it can save somebody life. And it might be your brother or sister or your mom or your grandmother is out of control like that. Kennedy's family also stressed the impact of gun violence on the youth, acknowledging change won't happen overnight, but. We gotta, we gotta figure out something as a, like as a community to come together and make it stand. With more local news, I'm Connor Stephan.